All new tonight, the state identified a probation officer is now part of a death investigation. He's on administrative duty tonight after a man he attempted to take into custody died. The encounter unfolded last night around 11 o'clock on Sykes Avenue in Wadesboro. Today, neighbors and witnesses told Eyewitness News reporter Tina Terry they want answers about what happened. Family members and neighbors say that that parole officer chased Lamont Perry back into this wooded area while trying to serve an arrest warrant last night. They never saw Perry alive again. I'm hurt. And I just need some answers. Lamont Perry's girlfriend didn't want us to show her face or share her name, but she wanted to talk about Perry, who somehow died last night as a parole officer tried to arrest him. Well, I would have never thought about this in a million and one years. She says she and Perry were at their apartment on Sykes Avenue in Wadesboro last night when he noticed a parole officer. She says he took off running through the back door. This morning, she says police contacted her saying they tracked Perry down in the woods where he'd fallen and was going in and out of consciousness. He later died. He was humble and he'll give you the shirt off his back if you needed it. Records show Perry was convicted of assault last month and was committed to parole. The SBI is investigating and says Perry was wanted for a parole violation related to an assault. They say he passed away during the arrest encounter. The Department of Public Safety says 23-year-old parole officer William Torrance was exercising the warrant along with some local officers. They say there is no indication that any shots were fired during the incident. Torrance is on administrative duty until the investigation wraps up. The SBI spent the day interviewing witnesses. They say they want to talk to anyone else who was here last night. Reporting from Wadesboro, Tina Terry, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.